wasn't quick enough. 46.08, and that puts Pyro right now in second place behind Remy with one team left to go, and that team is Trekker that we see right there. And Trekker's handler is Deb Frank out of St. Louis, Missouri. As you said, the last ones who might be able to knock Remy out of the lead. The score to beat is still 42-12. A Belgian Tavern is currently not seeing agility. Also a herding dog like the Border Collie. You know, he missed his contact right there. That'll be 10 seconds added to his score. Which That's means, shame. yeah, that, that, that means right now he is battling for second or third. There is no way that he can overtake Remy. Oh my goodness, look at these weave posts. Now, that was exceptional. Too bad, the rest of Run's looking good. He maybe could have been a contender for the top, but. Look at this footwork on this dog. This dog is plowing oh, through those weaves. <laughs> Holy cow. That's kind of like your slalom skier going through the gates, just pounding through them, somehow getting around them. This time makes sure and touch, touches that uh, safety zone coming over the A-frame. But as we said, that 10 second fault is going to cost him dearly. Headed towards the finish line now. Oh, nice job. 47.71, add on 10 seconds, 57.71, right there, right out of the gate. That was the problem. That cost him this event. And so it is Remy that finishes in the top spot as Trekker finishes with 57.71. Congratulations to Remy and Terry Smorch. Pyro, Ransom, Trekker, and Ozzy finish second, third, fourth, and fifth. Remy here and her owner, Terry, our winners today in the large dog agility competition. You had one.